So for any man that's watching this, kudos to your wife wearing a bra. You need to bring her flowers. I'm like the master bra remover. I would like to thank all of you lovely people that have noticed and left me nice little comments. The title of this video probably, why Michelle doesn't wear a bra. Hi everybody, welcome back. Welcome to my closet. No, I don't wear a bra. The title of this video probably, why Michelle doesn't wear a bra. I don't know, TMI, but let's go there. First of all, I would like to thank all of you lovely people that have noticed, not, there's some of you that have noticed, and left me nice little comments. Appreciate that. Appreciate that. If you go back through my comments, you won't see them because they're not there. They've been removed by me because I just did it. Don't want the world to see, hey, why don't you wear a bra? Let's talk about why I don't wear a bra. Summer's coming, and no, I don't wear a bra. If I could wear a bra, I would. But no, I don't wear a bra. Would I like to wear a bra? Believe it or not, I would. That sounds crazy, right? Sounds crazy? I know, it sounds absolutely crazy, but I would. Every woman out there knows the first thing you do when you get home is what? Take off your bra. They're tight, they're annoying, they don't fit right, they stretch, they, they, they're just annoying. So for any man that's watching this, kudos to your wife wearing a bra. You need to bring her flowers. Bring her flowers. Do whatever you want because bras suck. Bras, bras really suck. They do. So why don't I wear a bra? I can't. I can't. I have a rod in my spine that's about yay long right in the center of my back. And if I can find a picture of it, I'll post it like here. Have I tried wearing bras? I have bought every stinking single bra that I've ever seen on the internet, in magazines, in catalogs, shopping, out in the public, everywhere, everywhere. I have them all. I've had them all. I have them all. And I can't do it. In order for me to wear a bra, I have to take that, turn them around, that, this see all these and then this so in order for me to wear a bra i have to medicate myself i have to be medicated these are pain meds and a muscle relaxer i take these anyway every day i have to in order to function but if i know i'm gonna wear a bra i i have to like manage my meds around my bra which is crazy crazy but i have to do that and my bra only lasts I can only wear it a couple hours. Only a couple hours and then I take it off. And you know what? I have learned to take my bra off in so many places. If you are in front of me or sitting next to me, you probably wouldn't, wouldn't even know that I took it off. I've taken it off driving my school bus down the road. Nobody knew. My car, I've taken it off in restaurants. I've taken, I've taken it off in public places and just kind of stick it in my purse. Nobody knows. I'm like the master bra remover. I'm like a magician. I'm like a magician. That's pretty cool. Shopping, clothes shopping. It doesn't make that easy for me either because I have to buy clothes that I don't, I don't want people to know that I'm not wearing a bra, but sometimes it's inevitable you're gonna see so in the wet in winter, I'll wear scarves and sweaters or button down shirts that are extra oversized or sweatshirts. So you'll see me in a, a lot of clothes like that or my husband's shirts because they're just a little bit bigger. Now summer's coming and I, I can't wear t-shirts. I can wear this t-shirt around the house, but I have to wear like a tank top underneath every shirt that I have, every shirt. And it gets pretty warm in the summer but you do what you gotta do. I have ruffled shirts. You'll see me in some like strap, ruffled, 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 ruffled. You can't tell. Ruffles covers a lot. Ruffles will cover just about anything you want, want it to cover. That's why Michelle can't wear a bra. When I film a video, you'll only see like from here up, see, mm -mm 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 -mm. frame, frame is this. I try really hard not to film my whole body and if I do, like if I'm cutting vegetables or doing something like that, I'll do jump cuts. So in my videos you see a lot of jump cuts. That's because 
it takes, look at the jump cut, not me. The jump cut is so quick that hopefully oh, some people have noticed, but what are you going to do? So anyway, losing weight would be great because they'd be smaller. Can't do that either. Well, I've lost 20 pounds. I have lost 20 pounds since November. Yay, yay me. Good job, Michelle. But you see this causes weight gain, side effect, causes weight gain, side effect, causes weight gain. And then the muscle relaxer, side effect. You want to sleep. You want to just lay down and sleep. So, plus my activity level is minimal. What you see me do in the videos probably is all I did for the day. That is probably all I did for the day. If I'm out in the yard working with my husband, what you see me do is probably all I could do. And thank God I have a husband that helps me. He, he, he just helps me. He helps me out tremendously. I mean, there's even times where I'll push myself too hard. I might do three things that day. And he actually has to help me get in bed. Thank you, husband. Thank you, husband. Or he'll get everything I need. Never complains. Never nothing. You know, when I get overheated or too hot, that causes me pain. That causes me a lot of pain. So, the air conditioner is usually set on like 64, 66. So he dresses warmer you know i don't know i don't know but that's why i don't wear a bra strange video to make i know that i know that but for all of you out there that just needed to know or wanted to know there you go there's your answer and if you ever like comment again anybody about my booby situation <coughs> i'm going to refer you to this video that's my life that is my oh 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 one more thing not only have i had a spinal fusion with a rod and and all that good stuff but look if you ever noticed my scar in my videos scar i have had not one not one but two neck fusions not one i had a titanium implant put in about eight years ago or so and the disc above it and below it blew by blown i mean was herniated so the doctor went in and went through the same scar again and made the fusion bigger and now it's all bone i have all bone and screws and all that good stuff in my neck things cause me pain i can't do them it is what it is i've lived my life like this for quite a few years now it's just my life it's just my life all right well again never thought i'd make this video but yay me yay me all right stick around come back subscribe please subscribe that would be fun a lot of you that watched aren't even subscribed like 70 80 percent of you subscribe hit the little subscribe button you don't have to watch my videos but you know subscribe and if they pop up once in a while and it's something that you like hey click on it because we have a lot of fun around here all right i'll see you next time bye